Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I'm showing you how to make roasted sweet potatoes and broccoli that you can use as a side for meal prep or you can make a veggie bowl out of it. So let's get started. All right, so I'm starting off by chopping my sweet potato. So I've already washed and peeled two medium sweet potatoes. If you have one large sweet potato, that will work out perfectly. I didn't, so I just have two medium sized sweet potatoes and I'm trying to cut them into one inch pieces. You definitely want to make sure your vegetables, whatever you're roasting or cooking is cut into even sized pieces so they will all cook at the same time. All right, so now I'm adding some olive oil to the sweet potatoes and I will list the measurements um, down below in the description box, but I'm adding just a little bit of olive oil and this will help the sweet potatoes to roast nicely in the oven and it also helps any other ingredients that you add or seasonings that you add to stick to the sweet potatoes. So I'm adding just like a taco blend of seasoning. Um, I make my own taco seasoning now. So I'm just going to add a blend of that to the sweet potatoes and I'm also going to add it to the rest of the vegetables as well because I'm trying to get like a southwest flavor going here um, and certainly you can use whatever seasonings you want if you want to just use like cinnamon and um, ginger to kind of make your sweet potatoes sweeter that's perfectly fine the fun thing about roasting vegetables in the oven is you can kind of do whatever you want as long as you know what flavors go together and how long you need to roast your vegetables all right so I'm just spreading my sweet potatoes out evenly onto a cookie sheet and I am going to roast these first for 15 minutes in an oven for 425 degrees. Sweet potatoes take longer to roast, so that is the reason why I am putting them in there first. Now I'm gonna prep the rest of my ingredients. So I have some mini sweet peppers that I bought at the grocery store. If you can't find them in a pack like this, then feel free to just you know buy a couple of um, sweet peppers by themselves. But I like this convenient pack, so I always get it. <laughs> I get suckered into buying the pre-packaged vegetables sometimes, but I try not to because it costs too much. But <laughs> for something like this, I'm like, fine. All right, so I'm just prepping the peppers. So I'm kind of de-seeding them and then I'm cutting them into the same size pieces. So kind of like one inch pieces. All right, and so then I am prepping my red onion. This is certainly optional, but I love onion in dishes. I feel like it gives it so much flavor. Um, so you will often see me using a red onion or a yellow onion whenever I'm cooking any type of vegetables, whether it's skillet vegetables or if it's roasting vegetables, because I feel like it just gives it a lot of flavor. All right, so last but not least, I have some broccoli florets. Um, I don't know what size bag this is, but I'm gonna use the entire bag. I still rinsed it off, even though I probably didn't have to, but I rinsed it off and I'm adding it to the rest of my vegetables. And now it's time to season these vegetables. So I'm adding olive oil to them. And then I am going to season them with my uh, spice blend. And then I'm gonna mix this around really good. All right, so then after 15 minutes is up, I take my sweet potatoes out of the oven. I scoot them to the side. And I also try to turn them over if I can. You don't have to spend 30 minutes trying to flip over all your sweet potatoes, but if you can get a couple of them turned over, that it will be great because they are, you know, getting brown on both sides. All right, so then I just add the rest of my vegetables to the cookie sheet on the opposite side, and I kind of spread those out so they also cook evenly, so none of them are really stacked on top of each other. And really quick, I am using the Reynolds Wrap Non-Stick Aluminum Foil, and then I'm baking it in the oven for another 15 minutes. And there you have it, you guys. You have your beautifully roasted vegetables. These again are roasted sweet potatoes and then roasted broccoli medley um, with peppers and onions and really good spices, a lot of good flavor. And again, I turned mine into a vegetable bowl. I know sometimes people call these Buddha bowls, veggie bowls. Feel free to add some chicken if you want a little bit more protein. And then these are also perfect for meal prep. So I had a lot left over, so I made sure to package them as well so I can have some leftover 
pictures for tomorrow. All right, that's it, you guys. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please feel free to leave me a big thumbs up down below. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel so you'll never miss when I upload a video. See you next week.